let's talk about the Young Lions Cup, Nick. Yeah. Uh, what do you need to talk about? Well, right, let's talk about how I was snubbed. Snubbed? Snubbed in my own house. Well, aren't you the champion? That's correct. That's even more reason to be feeling like I was snubbed in the Young Lions Cup. Well, we have something crazy going on. I heard it was the top 16 professional wrestlers two years and under in that tournament. I was one of them. Not so much everybody in this commentary table. Well, what are you trying to say about me? Well, you already had your chance. You know, all of us, I don't know. Never mind. Alrighty. Anyways. You hugged him, not me, when I, I came to the commentary I table. I think if I was in that tournament, it might have been a different outcome. Maybe. I guess we'll just have to find out January 8th. We have anime's favorite sweetheart, Kid Bandit, and also Ishmael Vaughn, one of the deadliest spears in the business, decked out in gold. Oh, and here we go. Some custom made music right here. Wow! You gotta love it. But how can you can't blame the crowd? I mean, this is a faction that Brooke Havoc herself is in. NPR H. I cannot even hear my commentary partners. Money, power, respect. Getting all the respect from East Bay Faithful. Pacheco has really grown to love money, power, and respect. And with Coyle Del Mar in their corner, they're almost unstoppable. Look at those boots. Easy rope work. Definitely working that apron. Polo Del Mar, one of commentary's icons here at East Bay. Is that a kiss for me? No, it's for Brooke Havoc. Oh, sh a whole heartbeat. Oh, they got shirts. Gets, uh, get into your head a little bit over there, huh? Well, you know, when someone blows a kiss my way, you never know. I take them all. I might have to cop myself one of those vests there. I saw the Brooke Havoc fathead down there. That's yeah, that's cool. fantastic. Wow. I love that. Awesome, awesome. Oh, my oh. God. Wow. Oh, all right then. I'm going to have to ask Poyle who she was uh, talking to when she gets back up here. Oh, see wow. who the crowd's behind tonight. Kid Bandit and Ishmael Vaughn drove eight hours to feel some money, power, and respect. R-E-S-P-E-C-T. Represented. Marco saying, we love you, Brooke. Money, Indeed, power, respect, and havoc. Love it. A, a future faction here, Robert? Already oh, a yeah, faction. They, they, yeah. Brooke Havoc joined them. Uh, some time ago, I don't, yeah. I don't Two know. months ago. Oh man. Sometime in time, uh, time, time October. Flies. Time flies. I dropped in my head too many times. <laughs> Maybe a oh. few more on the eighth. I'm already getting sick to my stomach, and the match has not even started yet. Brooke Chance echoing through East Bay Pro Wrestling once again. Don't forget to donate. Miss Garcia, what do you know about these two teams? Uh, these two teams right here. So we got a little bit of Kid Bandit and Ish uh, from the Young Lions Cup, and I was very impressed. Um, some of my first times, first looks seeing these two. 
but uh, NPR here I know very well, and although I had my differences between uh, Fabuloso and Marco, I've actually gained the respect that they deserve. Love it. You know, the highlight, I like their combination. You got the power of Ishmael Vaughn, the high flying of Kid Bandit. Indeed. Hair versus hair here. I mean, Oof. Kid Bandit was something. Oh, oh, snap. The power of Fabuloso, but the agility of Kid Bandit. Filling each other out here. You know, people always ask me if it's hard for me to keep up with my hair, but uh, I feel like I could throw that question back at to Kid Bandit. I've seen Kid Bandit straightening his hair in the locker room. Definitely well upkept, very soft, smells great. Good to know. He's on a different level. If you follow him on Twitter, you'll know what I'm talking about. He does some really nice cosplays. Oh, does he now? Yep. A lot of anime stuff? Yeah, a lot of anime. Some Miko, uh, what, what's her name? Miko Ito from Japan. I personally am gonna leave it to you, Robert. I thought you were well educated on the subject since you started it. Apparently not. Nonetheless, we know that Kid Bandit loves his anime, loves My Hero Academia. Marco looks like he knows Ooh. some anime. We like some little karate kid more than anime, but. Nonetheless, we got a waist lock. Doesn't look like it's gonna work against Marco though. No, Kid Bandit on an uphill battle versus two bigger men. He has to somehow find Ishmael into the ring here. Oh, and a standoff. And a standoff between the two. Let me tell you something, beautiful tank top on Marco. Brook Havoc. Uh, nice, wrist nice wrist lock, nice wrist lock. Cartwheel by Bandit reverses the wrist lock into one of his own. Both men with some technical prowess here to start the match. And I believe a blind tag was made, that's right. But uh, Marco has not realized that there's oh. been a tag yet. I'm not even sure Bandit has realized. Uh... Ishmael sooner or later has to get in the ring. Karina Kyle, please gain control of this. Uh, okay, this is something very special between the two. Elbow drops. Elbow drops, man, they've been popular tonight. You know, Karina Kyle's got to get some control of this matchup. They were in there for way longer than five seconds. I'll tell you what, with the way the officiating has gone tonight, it would not surprise me if we've seen a DQ. Ishmael Vaughn in there with some agility of his own. Now with strikes to uh, Fabulosa Fabricio. Down, even though Vaughn is getting hyped up. Shades of Gangrel. Ishmael Vaughn. Oh, oh look at that. Of the eyes. Not very classy. I tell you what, NPR, they're fan favorites, but they're known to break the rules. I rakes on a premium tonight. Big Insiguri in the corner by Fabuloso. Tag to Marco Mania. I cannot believe he did that. The athleticism to get up there for that Insiguri. Double whip, Ishmael Vaughn coming up. Oh my god! Lupez press, Marco Mania coming up. Sexy oh. time splash. And a senton. Pretty of these sure. Guys need to pin Ish. I tell you what, Kid Fab Bandit. and Marco are both over 250. It's a lot of man coming down on you. Kid Bandit better thank his lucky stars. This is not him idea. under all this. Another elbow drop. And I'm you're right, Nick. You, he's got to go for the pin. They got to go for the pin. Oh my gosh! And Ishmael looks to pop up. Big boom. Is he gonna lift him up? He's got him. More John Cena. Let's 
Oh my nice. goodness. Let me tell you something. I know something about resiliency. Ishmael yes. Vaughn's got some resiliency. To take all that punishment from NPR and pop up and do that maneuver takes a lot of effort. I'll tell you what, as you could tell, a lot of John Cena influence tonight. The highlighted full yeah. control now. Oh my god. Solid kick. Ishmael Vaughn with the splash down on all fours. More poetry in motion! Oh. Oh. He kind of oh, slipped up his there. Knee, his knee, his knee, his knee. His knee, his knee. Oh, it looks like Kid Bandit Kid might Bandit be injured. Kid Bandit might have tweaked his knee here. Oh, no, 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 Could no, 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 Could be very unfortunate. No, 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 no. Fabuloso with the tag. This is not good for the highlight. It looks like Kid Bandit may be compromised here. He's not been able to put any weight on that knee. Oh, my goodness. Double backtracker by NPR. Karina Kyle, please make sure everybody is okay in this match. Kid Bandit kicking out. Five minutes left in this contest. Kid Bandit needs to get the tag as soon as possible. He's not doing okay right now. Fabuloso with those knees right to the back of Kid Bandit. Now raining down elbows. You could question NPR's tactics throughout the match, but smartly cornering the smaller man, wearing him down. They're showing why they're the tag team champions here at Pacheco Square Garden. Kid Bandit trying to come back. Oh my. He's fighting through the pain. Here we go, tag to Marco. Butterfly backbreaker. Marco Mania coming down. Demolition oh style. Gosh. This is not good for Kid Bandit. This is not good for Ishmael Vaughn or the highlight collectively. Karina Kyle with a two count. Kid Bandit barely got out of that. That's right, Robert, barely. Do not forget to donate to Brooke Havoc. Marco Mania with Kid Bandit on his shoulder, spinning around, airplane spin. Oh my. Oh. Takes him down. Kid Bandit's in trouble. Airplane spin, Michinoku of sorts. Time Marco loves his sexy time. He takes off that Brook Havoc tank top. Oh, I don't know why he didn't throw it up here. I want it. I believe so. ProWrestlingTees.com. Again, Kid Bandit has taken so much punishment. He's barely kicking out, but he's showing the perseverance. He's still that knee. Some resiliency, if you will, Robert. You know about that. You'll see that on the eight. Nonetheless, we have tag team action here. Oh, oh my oh. goodness. I think that might be it. I think it's over. Oh, oh and Ishmael Vaughn making liner. sure that this is not the end of this contest. Polo Del, Del Mar. Mar. <laughs> Jinx, you owe me a title shot. <laughs> Sexy shoulders are always, always a fan favorite here in Pacheco. Nonetheless, Kid Bandit's still in trouble here. Marco Mania, he can barely walk on that knee. Ice bath on a premium today. Oh my goodness. Ishmael Vaughn has to find a way to get in this match. I know Kid Bandit is tough, but we have to find a way to create some momentum. Six, Look at one, that. Nine. Right Regardless to the gut. The pain, Kid Bandit is pushing through here. It looks like he's going to go up and over. No. Shots to the gut. He's Not a smart up. move. He's going over. No. Springboard. Spinning oh. kick. Oh. This that is so Worse for wear is that leg of Kid Bandit, but connects with the waifu kick. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but it landed 100%.
Kid Bandit crawling towards Ishmael Vaughn. This is his opportunity. Oh, oh Coyo! Coyo, no! That's do you have exactly, something to do with this? I that's, don't. I swear I don't. That's exactly why I told her no to her managerial offer. I said no. The tag to Marco Mania. Kid Bandit still in the ring. He needs to make that tag. But NPR with the double team here. They're going for the drip. Oh, oh, he reversed it. Oh! Double knocker knocker. And they're scrambling. Back elbow. Oh, kick to the face. Oh, here we go now. Just what? when you think Kid yeah, Bandit's down and out. And he makes that tag. House of Fire! Ishmael Vaughn on fire now. Clothesline, back elbows. Cooking it down. Oh! oh! Damn! I don't know what you call that. Coyle's not having any of this. Coyle, watch out! No! Oh, Coyle no. took a tumble. Oh my God, Ishmael Vaughn struggling to lift my Marco up. Watch out, here comes No, 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 oh my God. And they take advantage of another leg. MPR, love them, hate them. They know how to get the job done. Dumping Ishmael Vaughn out of the ring and Kid Bandit who took all that punishment earlier in this matchup is still in the ring. Oh my goodness, and he's planning an attack out oh, to the back of the head. MPR really now. Ishmael Vaughn, the legal man of the two. You gotta figure if Karina Kyle's gonna gain control. There's only so much she can do when NPR is taking control of Kid Bandit. They can't keep doing this. this is I see Miss La Resistance and Spike Dudley stuff. Oh, Ishmael Vaughn goes crashing and burning as Kid Bandit flies over the top rope. Money, power, and respect in control. Checking on Kid Bandit. I think Kid Bandit is seriously injured here. I think MPR is trying to... Yeah, trying we, to get the TKO on here. We have other referees coming out to check on Kid Bandit. Oh no, Ishmael Vaughn might have to finish this match by himself. I feel for these guys again, drove eight hours to be here and finding themselves in one hell of a predicament. The lights turn on in the arena. Thank and you now... so much for the follow, guys. We're off camera. Things are, things are breaking down. Things are breaking down. was over for him. He dives off the scaffold. This is awesome. The highlight recycling MPR and now they are finding themselves on the doorstep of victory. And here we go, the shadow the shadow what? The shadow bread is what they call that. Shadow bread. Oh, oh, Fabuloso in to break up the cover. 
What is it gonna take to gain a victory tonight? Both teams have something to prove. Spare! Hoyle Del Mar is losing <laughs> her mind. Kid Bandit dove off of the second floor of Pacheco Square Garden. The only man to do it since D-Road. Uh, oh, and the knee, you gotta believe, has played a part again. Big clothesline by Mark Lariat. Money, power, and respect look to close in on another victory here at East Bay. Can they do it? Oh, and the future is Devered. That's gotta be it. Nobody Heartbreak for the highlights. What a match! NPR just showed why they're the East Bay Pro, the WWC, and the Student Showcase Champions right here live on Twitch. How does it go again, Aaliyah? Respect! Let's not bury the lead. Kid Bandit, Ishmael Vaughn giving it all they had, all the heart, all the resilience, even took it to the lengths of diving off a scaffold. But bottom line, money, power, respect. <laughs>